Hello, my name is Rachel and welcome to my channel. Today I have for you an intermediate level workout. All you're going to need is your mat, so go ahead and get ready and I'll see you in a moment. Okay, so let us begin. We are going to start sitting up with our knees bent, our feet hip width apart, pulling the abdominals in, hands underneath your knees, and use those arms to gently draw your spine into a nice long line. So imagine this thread in the top of your head pulling you upwards, creating that nice straight back. Hands underneath are slightly pulling as well, so we're generating a little bit of work in our arm muscles. So now you're going to take a breath in, expanding your ribs out to the side, and as you exhale, I want you to pull the belly in and just try and round your lower back without your shoulders moving forward or back. So trying to keep them in the same place and just flex the spine, then you're going to inhale up. And we're going to do two more, exhaling, drawing in, inhaling, lifting up, and exhaling, really scooping in. So this is just to wake up those core muscles, and inhale, coming up. Now as you exhale, scooping in, coming back, feeling those arms lengthen, let's take the arms away. Just tap the mat with your lower back, take a breath in, exhale, come back up, reaching over your legs and restack the spine. And again, so you're going to exhale, scooping in those abdominals, tucking under with the tailbone, tapping the back with your waistband, coming up, reaching forward and lifting up. One more, exhale, coming down. Inhale, exhale, coming forward, reaching up, and then restacking that spine. Okay, from there, let's take the hands down and come down onto the floor. We're going to do our pelvic curl, so we're going to press our hands down into the floor, trying to feel that activity in the arms. You're going to take a breath in, you're going to exhale to tilt the pelvis peeling the spine up off the floor. Okay, so we want tummies in, we want a nice long line through the legs there, then you're going to inhale, exhale, relaxing through the chest and coming back down. Deep breath in. So exhale, think of scooping in here, tilting, lifting up, inhale and Exhale, as you come down, we're going to go a little faster, deep breath in, exhaling to tilt, and roll up, inhale, and exhale to come down, deep breath in, again, tilt, peel that spine up, inhale, and exhale down, one more, deep breath in, and tilt, and lifting up, inhale, and exhale, coming all the way down, and we're going to bring the right leg up into our tabletop position, then the left leg, so let's have our knees and ankles together, we're pulling the tummy in, we're taking the arms out to the side, we're breathing in as we take our knees over to the right, we're breathing out, to bring them back. So this is our warm-up we're doing right now. Over and exhale up. Inhale over and exhale up. So let's get that breathing going. Good. Over and exhale up and inhale over and exhale up. To make it more challenging now we're going to extend the legs Make sure your abs are drawing in. Let's continue. Inhale over and exhale up. Inhale over and exhale up. Inhale over 
and exhale up one more inhale over and exhale up now you're going to bring your right knee into your chest you're going to lower that left leg down so what about 45 degrees let's lift the head and chest up come for as high as you can with that chest take a breath in exhale we're going to switch and switch and switch and switch so we're really reaching the legs out and we're breathing in and out with each one eight seven six five four three two one now stay there take the hands behind the head let's continue with the legs and eight seven six five four three two one stay there lift up now let's rotate towards that right knee deep breath in and switch 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 keep rotating as much as you can for eight seven six five four three two one inhale bring the knees in lift the tailbone up at this point exhale send the legs out inhale in exhale out inhale in exhale out inhale in exhale out one more in and exhale out now draw the tummy muscles in take a breath in and as you exhale press your back into the floor and lower those legs all the way down take the head down reach those arms overhead we want our ribs down at this point so make sure they're down we're going to do our roll up so we're going to inhale to move the arms head and chest you're going to hold it here for a moment then you're going to exhale pull the tummy muscles in and come up into your roll up position taking a breath in you're going to exhale as you go back down and reach the arms overhead so inhale moving the arms head and chest exhale as you come up take a breath in exhale we are pulling that belly in towards the spine and arms overhead inhale exhale we're trying to keep it nice and smooth inhale exhale as you come back we'll do two more deep breath in exhale up inhale there and exhale as you come down and one more inhale exhale up take a deep breath in and as you exhale we're just going to come back a little way can you see i'm just back here i'm going to bring my legs in towards me <coughs> excuse me and then we're going to lift the legs up and we're going to put our hands on our shins preparing for the rolling exercise now you can do this with the feet relax I like to do it with my feet pointed just to really point those toes and work the foot muscles. Okay, shoulders are relaxed. And then from here, what we're going to do is start to tip back by pulling the abs in. So you keep pulling in, you keep pulling in until you fall back, at which point you're going to inhale and then exhale to come back up. So we're inhaling back and exhaling up you want to go just onto your shoulder blades but you don't want to go onto your neck so again back and up inhale back and up we can do two more back and up and back and up we 
we're going to hold it here. We're going to lift our legs into tabletop and place the hands underneath. Now look straight ahead at your feet. From here, I want you to exhale and try and take your spine down onto the floor whilst keeping your legs still. Then we're going to inhale, head's going to come forward. We're going to lift up and draw the shoulders back and down. So exhale, scooping in, coming back. Inhale, head forward, lifting up and drawing the shoulders down. Exhale, scooping in, tucking under, coming back. Inhale, forward and up. And this time we're going to exhale, we're going to come down. And we're going to hold it here. We're going to try and keep this height. And we're going to bring the knees in towards us. Place the hands on the top of the knees. And as you breathe in, you're going to shoot your arms and your legs straight out like this. As you exhale, circle the arms and pull the knees back into the chest. So inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. So you're trying to reach the arms past the ears. Two. One. Lift the legs up, place the hands back underneath and let's send the head forward and bring ourselves back up. Let's draw the shoulders down and see if you can extend your legs as far as your hamstrings will allow. Draw your shoulders down, so use your arms to help you here. Lengthen through the back and then you're just going to take your arms out. We're going to hold it here for five, four, three, two, one, and take the legs down. Well done. Okay, let's go into a sitting exercise now. So you're sitting up with your feet about the width of the mat, nice and tall with the spine. We're gonna take our arms out to the side. I'm gonna do a little exercise that's really nice for the shoulders. I had this little shoulder twist, which I really love. All right, so we're going to rotate to our right. So I want you to look down at your right foot. And as you reach forward, so you're going to reach forward to your little toe. This right shoulder is going to turn in. Can you see? Right shoulder is turning in. As you come up, you're going to turn that shoulder out and then bring the arm in line with the shoulder and then open out to the side. So let's go left. We'll break it down. We're going to go left. We're going to reach forward towards the little toe. We're going to turn the left shoulder in. We're going to turn the left shoulder out as we come up and then bring the left arm in line with the shoulder and open. So we're going to go right, turn the arm in, turn the arm out, align and open. We're going to go left, turn the shoulder in, turn the shoulder out, align it, and open two more right shoulder goes in shoulder goes out align and open and left shoulder turns in shoulder turns out align and open we're going to bring those hands down and legs together so i want the legs straight toes pointed back straight but we are leaning back and we're going to place our hands out to the side. So you can have fingers pointing out like this. If you've got the flexibility in your shoulders, have them pointing towards you. And I want you to tuck your chin and retract your chin. So we are working inside the neck muscles there. Now look straight ahead at the wall. Breathe out and press into the feet and the hands and let your eyes drift up the wall towards the ceiling. So we're in a reverse plank. And then you're going to inhale to lower down. We're going to exhale, lifting up. And we're going to inhale to lower down. So we're hinging at the hips and the shoulders, coming up and lower down. Lifting up 
and lower down and one more lifting up and lower down well done okay so from here we're going to come and lie down and we're going to do some inversions so lying all the way down on the floor we're going to bring our legs up uh, tabletop first of all and then let's extend them this is called the rollover okay so we're going to be very careful that we don't put weight in our neck here we're going to pull the abdominals in and we're going to reach those legs away as you breathe in you're going to come to 90 degrees as you breathe out you're going to roll over and the weight is on your shoulder blades at this point you're going to flex the feet you're going to separate the feet and we're going to gently lower the toes towards the floor so you're getting a lovely stretch in your hamstrings then you're going to roll down through the spine draw a little circle and come back so inhale to 90 degrees exhale to roll over flex the feet separate the feet lower the toes towards the floor and exhale coming down and drawing a little circle repeat inhale to 90 exhale over flex separate and lower and then you're going to roll all the way down drawing a little circle and back now we're going to reverse the legs so I want you to start with your feet hip width apart and flex we're going to inhale to 90 exhale over you're going to point your toes draw the legs together and lower those toes overhead and you're going to exhale coming down through the spine circling the feet out and flex and again inhale to 90 exhale over point draw the legs together and lower them down exhale coming down and circling out and flex the feet one more inhale to 90 exhale over point to draw the legs together and lower down and exhale coming all the way down circling out and flex the feet well done let's bend the knees and pink the feet down on the floor coming onto your side and we are going to be up on our elbow extending the legs and we're going to put one hand behind the head so we to really lift under here okay so we've got this foot slightly forward this leg is going to lift up we're going to flex the foot and from here we're going to go forward for one two and back one two when you go back don't arch the back okay so we're trying to keep still in the trunk one two and back one two back back forward forward and back back well done bring that leg over we're going to bend the knees push ourselves up and take the arm out getting ready to do our side bend so you're going to breathe in lifting up breathing out we're going to go over and as you go over try and lift a little higher inhale to that T position exhale lower down inhale lift exhale over inhale up and lower down and lift and over and up and lower down we'll do four lifting up and over and lift and from there we're going to twist and come into our plank position drawing the shoulders down tummy muscles in and then from here bring the right knee in take it back left knee in and back right knee in and back left knee in and back and four three two or one pushing up into your up stretch lowering those heels lifting the heels 
Keeping the heels up, I want you to lower your bottom down towards your heels, as far down as you can get, and then a little jump forward. Fabulous. <laughs> and then onto the other side, okay? So we're on our elbow. We've got bottom leg towards the corner of the mat. Top leg is going to be lifted. We're lifting in our core, hand behind the head. Flex the foot, go forward and back. And forward and back. And forward. So keep pushing into this elbow so you're lifting up forward and back. And forward and back. Two more. And back and back. We're going to bring this leg over. We're going to push ourselves up, preparing for the side bend. Are you ready? Here we go, lifting up and over. As you go over, lift those hips. Inhale to the T and exhale to lower down. Breathing in to lift. Breathing out to go over. Inhale up and lower down. Two more. Lift and over and up and lower down last one lift and over and up let's rotate back into our plank position now holding it here drawing the tummy muscles in lengthening through that spine point the toes on the right foot we're going to lift and lower lift and lower lift and lower lift and lower four three two one tuck the toes under let's go to the other leg lift and lower lift and lower lift lift and lower for four three two one tuck the toes under lift up into your up stretch and let's lower those heels. Good. Give yourself a nice stretch there. Lift the heels. Bend the knees once again. Tummies in. Bringing the bottom down towards the heels. Little jump forward. Well done. And come and lie down. Okay. So what we're going to do now is the jackknife. So hands are down by your side, legs are lifted and extended. All right, we're going to inhale to bring our legs from 60 to 90 degrees, exhale to go over. Now at this point, you can leave your arms down if you're experienced. If you're not sure, you can put your hands on your hips. You're going to lower the legs down and then you're going to reach up as far as you can in the air, pushing into those arms. And then you're going to exhale, come down through the spine. And back to the start position. And again, so inhale to 90, exhale over, lower the legs down. And as you inhale, reach them up. Holding it there. Exhale. Coming all the way down. And back. Let's do one more if we can. Inhale to 90. Exhale over. Lower the legs. And as you inhale, reach up. Keep reaching. And then exhale. Coming all the way down. Lifting yourself up, I want you to cross the feet, press forward onto your hands and reach back into your plank position. So press into those hands, lengthen through the body and we're just going to do a little press up. So you do not have to go all the way down unless you can. Alright, we're going to do a little bend and straighten, bend and straighten, bend and straighten, reaching up into your up stretch, lower the heels down, lift the heels up and come back. Let's try that again, a little bend and straighten, 
bend and straighten, bend and straighten, lifting up, lower the heels down, lift the heels up, and that third and final time, bend and straighten, bend and straighten, bend and straighten, lifting up, lower the heels, lift the heels, come down. Now this time, pull the tummy in, bend those elbows, and with control, let's lower to the floor. Release those feet. All right. And then from here, we're going to reach around, take hold of the right foot. Reach around, take hold of the left. All right. We're going to take the head down, take a breath in, and as you breathe out, you're going to press the feet into the hands. Think of the toes towards the ceiling, feeling that lovely stretch through the legs and the shoulders. And then coming back down. And again, deep breath in, breathing out, pushing into those feet, finding that stretch in the body, lovely stretch in the thighs, and that back extension. And down. And one more, pressing into the feet, lifting up, going to wherever your body, your back will allow. And slowly coming down. Wonderful. Release the feet, hands under the shoulders, tuck the toes under, and we're just going to lift ourselves back up into our plank position, lifting from there into our up stretch. Lower the heels down, lift the heels up, and coming back. And again, let's lift, lower, lift and down and last one lift lower and then from here we're going to bend our knees at this time we're going to take our knees all the way down to the floor release the feet open the knees up and sink your chest down and just take some deep breaths there And in your own time, come on up. All right, and that's your workout for today, everyone. So thank you so much for coming. If you liked this intermediate level workout, do let me know by pressing the like button and sending a, a comment to me below because I do read all your comments. Thanks for joining me. Do come and see me again soon. And don't forget to subscribe and share with your friends. Take care. Have a good day. Bye for now.